There's only Jinx now? She said that to Caitlyn? What? <laughs> oh! Oh! I was gonna change your- Whoa, look at Vi! I think this is about to be one of the best moments in our life. <laughs> Pretty much. Um, so if you haven't come across us before, we are Arcane super fans. We are huge fans of Arcane. Arcane changed our whole lives. Oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, yeah, we literally started our channel because we were obsessed with Arcane. Yes. And now the season two trailer is out. Oh my gosh. It came out today. It came out today. 15 and hours ago. 15 time hours recording. ago time recording. Yes. And I was on the other side of town. Yep. And so it like came up on my feed on the YouTube feed <laughs> and I wanted to click it so badly. <laughs> the Me too. To click that video thumbnail was just like next level. Yeah. Huge urge. Oh yeah. And oh, yeah. I was like no I'm going to wait so I can watch it with my beloved wife <laughs> and all of you fine individuals. Yes, 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 yes. yes. Mm -hmm. I remember when I got the notification, I messaged her. I'm mm -hmm. like, babe, the trailer's out. Yeah. <laughs> it's been many that. hours since then. Yeah. That being said, we're going to read some comments from the previous trailer, and then we're going to watch it. Like, mm -hmm. more like a teaser, not really a trailer. The, the previous mm -hmm. one was, yeah. This one's a real trailer. All right, up. we have Arthur. I think this could be a really cool act for Jinx in Season 2, mm -hmm. realizing that she can be more than just a menace. Ah. She can be a force of change for good in the Undercity. Yeah. Basically becoming Robin Hood and taking down corrupt rich people and being loved for it. Ooh. I also like Savika's words that her so reminiscent to Mel to Jay's season one. Mm. You're a symbol of the future now, whether you like it or not. I mm. now feel like we're going to see them swapping roles mm. this season, with Jinx being the beacon of progress, while mm. Jace becomes the force of destruction by making Ooh. more weapons and ordering martial law and all that stuff. Oh, that would be quite a change. Also, yeah. FYI, the blue mags in Savika's face have been there since the explosion episode three. Yeah, I, I once you mentioned that, I was like, oh yeah, that's when that <laughs> happened. <laughs> okay, I did not notice that. Yeah, so I've been paying attention. Yeah. Or rather, I should do my best to pronounce the name. Ash says, the whole lower city this season, I'm blue, da ba dee da ba die. I'm getting really curious about how Jinx and Sabika join forces. Right? Us as well. Uh -huh. Arthur again. As for Caitlyn, I think her arc is going to also parallel some of Jinx in season mm -hmm. one. Jinx became so obsessed with Caitlyn as her enemy that she lost sight of her real goals and kept pushing <sighs> by further and further away. Yeah. I think this time Caitlyn will be the one so obsessed with Jinx that she'll forget what she really cares about and push by away temporarily. Oh, I hope it's very short. Yeah. I am a big fan of Caitlyn and Vi together. <laughs> of course. I need those little chest yes. pieces to stand next to each other in battle. Okay? Yes. That picture mm -hmm. of her with all the red strings over is oddly reminiscent mm -hmm. of the scene where Jinx looks at her reflection in the broken mirror and argues with herself over whether or not Vi cares about Caitlyn. Is it not? I agree oh. with that. The other thing I noticed about this poster is that both Kayla and Jinx have one eye in the shadow and one eye in the light, huh? which I think means both are going to give big choices this season. Jinx, who has been a villain, for, given big yeah, choices, yeah. villain for so long, gets the opportunity to become a hero, mm -hmm. and Caitlyn, who has wanted nothing but to help people, gets tempted to go down a DACA path, and personally, I can't wait to see how it goes. Wow. You all think, <laughs> a lot of people think Caitlyn is going to yeah, be drawn into I mean, into I sort of, in the back of my mind, rock. I'll be honest with you, when we uh -huh. saw the very first teaser, which mm -hmm. was just them talking mm -hmm. and when she talked about how if they go alone or if she goes alone one of them goes get, ends up in a box right mm -hmm. i was already thinking that got thoughts for caitlin but i like to think not like that because <sighs> caitlin's a sweet cupcake and there's nothing wrong her entire life <sighs> and then we have blank shot 641 you two need to cosplay as vi and kate for the premiere <laughs> okay so we've been wanting to cosplay as vi and caitlin for a long time yep we did do once last year mm -hmm. at dragon con we cosplayed pinup versions we of vi and caitlin we did and yeah, we haven't done an all out version of them yet. So, like, you might be convincing me that this has to happen. <laughs> that said, like, I don't super want to wear a wig. Mm -hmm. So, I'm considering dyeing my hair blue. Mm. And we'll just give you some fresh red. Yay! Because um, hers was red and it faded to pink. Yes. So, she'll have some fresh red and then I'll dye my hair blue and we'll figure out, like, if we want to do a casual version or something. Yeah. But it would be really fun. And again, this is literally a once in a lifetime thing. Yeah. For us to get a season of Arcane. Like, yeah. I mean, this is the second time in our lifetime to get a season of Arcane. <laughs> But for us to get it while we have a channel, yeah. because we built our channel after watching the yep. first season. It's true. So uh, just to now have a place to put our viewing of a season is a once in a lifetime thing. It sure thing. is. So, all right. Yeah. I know you're excited. Yeah. I'm excited. I know I've you all are excited. All 
Are you ready? I've been ready all day. Yeah, me too, though. I just wasn't here yet. <laughs> but now I'm here. Yeah. Let's go check it out. I'm Jenny. Get in. And we are going to be watching the, the heck new, out of... <laughs> the new official trailer of season two of Arcane. Bring it on. Yeah. Here we freaking go. It is two minutes and 20 seconds, but a lot can happen, especially with this show. This feels so unreal. Oh, it's my Jinx. gosh. It's like from that early look <gasps> we got. Shh, <gasps> Oh, oh my gosh. <gasps> There's only Jinx now? She said that to Caitlyn? <gasps> oh, shoot. Wow. Okay. Oh, I'm oh ready. Oh, my gosh. <gasps> wow. <laughs> oh. oh. That's not so Anguish. Great. <sighs> oh. oh, my God. The this music is so is good. So no. good. Oh, Sadika. Uh, you Damn. were right. Damn. You were so right that that was Sabika. Yeah. We saw her before. I didn't yeah. believe you. I've never. Yeah. <laughs> oh! No. What the what? No. Watch it all burn. Oh. Oh my gosh. Jinx. Wow, look at all the colors. This November, which we know. Yeah, I know the colors. Wow. And everything ends. Oh. oh. We just saw Weirwick. There's a new. What? <gasps> that looked like it was a result of the hex tag. Uh. <gasps> Echo! Oh my gosh. Whoa. Oh no. <gasps> Echo's oh. gonna change your. Whoa, look at Vi! Oh my gosh. Oh. oh. Whoa! That's Jinx? That's sick! <gasps> Look! Oh my gosh! She looks amazing! Holy shoot! Do we get a release date, Riot? Ah! It's November! When in November? We don't know! Ah. We don't know. Alright, so... There's a lot to unpack here, quite frankly. Yeah. Okay, interesting, we've got this really top view of the council. Mm -hmm. Is this essentially when everything goes down? We've got Mel right here. Mm -hmm. Is that what happened beforehand? Mm -hmm. We had the explosion right here, so wow. this is not... So this is, like, picking up where but season one left this off. This is huge! Okay. My sister is gone! Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. And Caitlyn did say this, even though I haven't seen Articana in over some years, uh -huh. that... Her sister was gone at the tea party, we call it the tea party. And so for Vi to essentially like realize this and say this is huge. There's only Jinx now. Wow. So this cloaked figure here, we happen to see Jinx in the very similar ensemble later on in the trailer. I'm wondering if that's her cloak. I was also wondering if that was her be. cloak too. It could be. Oh my gosh, Caitlin. Oh, I want to tear that laugh from her throat forever. So, I hate to say it. This is mm -hmm. all pointing to Cassandra's down demise. Mm -hmm. I, I still want to believe she's okay. Mm -hmm. Maybe she's just really hurt, okay? Okay, look at Vi. She's got her band he's got her nose like this and I we did see her really uh, upset. Oh, look her at this. Anguish. She's got a bandage right here too. Yeah. Interesting. Oh, she's crying. Like it looks like a metal looks like bandage. Metal. Yeah. yeah. Okay, like and then we've seen this where they're all kind of hanging out yeah. here. Yeah, this is so, such a different experience to watch it all together. Yeah, though. it is. Even if, like, ah, these like... are some of them glimpses of things we've seen before. But watching it all together as one is something You else. must declare martial law. <sighs> so is this Jace? We don't. So here's a couple things. Jace is part well of the be. council. May we well haven't be. seen any of the members of the council. Mm. Could be Jace, not sure. Could but be, yeah. she's saying declare martial law. Mm -hmm. We see these enforcers. We see Sadika. Those were firelights, so though. One of them had yeah. a mask, what you were just showing. Can you go back a bit? I'm trying to check out Sadika's new outfit. It's really cool looking. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh, that happened too. Yeah, I don't. Wow. I think there it is. There it is. Oh, <gasps> damn. Oh, the damn. Enforcer the Enforcer coming the for a firelight. Yep. Wow. And then we've got Savika here in some really awesome. You have armor. the change. Look at the all chance. these people. The 
To rally the under So this is actually quite interesting, right? Because, again, Sabika and Jinx are working together. Uh Uh-huh. And then we have this right here. And this Uh is, remember I told you Bai had darker hair? Yeah, yeah. So she's seeing that this is, like, the colors of, like, New Hope. And they've got Vander Uh right here in this all. Which is so interesting. And I mentioned the last time we were watching the other, um, the last little clip that we Mm -hmm. got. That it must be really something for Vi to see that image of Vander behind Jinx. Mm -hmm. Because Vander really taught Vi. He didn't really teach Powder slash Jinx as much. He took Vi under his wing and was training her to be a mini Vander. So if anyone is like the new Vander, it's Vi. Okay, so I thought there was a scene here with mm. someone protecting. Okay, they, oh my gosh. Okay, mm. there's the enforcers that we saw, the new ones. Mm-hmm. Okay, yeah, there's that guy, that guy. Okay, so mm-hmm. I saw that. All right, what else we got here? I don't see Caitlyn anywhere there. Mm-hmm. All right, then we see all the different colored smoke everywhere. It's like taking people wow. in. So okay, let this me see so for a hot minute. Up. Okay, this reminds me very much of the Joker. Mm-hmm. Now, obviously, this is not laughing gas, but yeah. like his toxin or whatever. So when I see all these different clouds and people getting mm-hmm. submerged to them, mm-hmm. and when Caitlyn mentioned I want to rip that laughter out, uh, I'm like, that's like the Joker. Uh, I still feel like Jinx is. Hold on, let me lean forward because if you lean forward that much, then I'm like in a shadow. Gotcha. This November, which we know, we still don't know when. I don't want to look like I'm like an evil half face. Right. <laughs> okay, so she's definitely leading the charge, Mel's mom. Mm. Is this the place? No, 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 never mind. That looks like the hex core kind of. A- yeah. It doesn't look exactly like it, but it looks. Like that's the closest. Here's thing a field to of it. flowers. Now this could be again reaching because I haven't seen Arcane in a long time. Uh-huh. But I do remember when Young Jace met the the mad the the mage or whatever you want to call him in the beginning that he mm. kind of was like in a very naturey area. Mm. I'm not sure if that's a throwback to that or not. They're singed. Mm. There's Weirdwick for sure. Mm. Is a new beginning. Hmm. Oh, it says the arcane. The arcane. Okay, and this, this looks like it's people being taken over by the hex tech kind I don't of stuff. No, do you think it's real magic? I think it might be magic because mm. it looks like there's runes on her, mm. and there's runes over here that we can't really make out, mm. and all these different markings. I don't know 100. percent But like, look this at this. Does. Yeah, this really does. is waking up. The arcane is waking up though, uh, and I associate arcane with magic. With the art, like real magic. Yeah, with real magic. Yeah. Okay, then we've got Jinx right here. We got one uh, of those things again. We've got Caitlyn getting ready to and shoot the little something. one on the left. That, I still think that's Ren. That is very often theorized to be Ren. Okay, yes. so then we've got Echo here. Wow, sometimes it's taking a leap. <laughs> that's a terrifying picture. Although yeah. it's kind of cool wallpaper. Mm-hmm. All right, then we have here. Oh, is this Victor? This is Victor. Oh. Something's happening here with Hex. Wasn't Victor in the council room? So we know he's okay. Ah. Uh, okay. Uh, something else is happening here. It could be with the Hex. Mm-hmm. It looks like it could very well be related to the Hex core. Like, look at this. This looks yeah. demonic almost. Okay. Yeah. Oh, there's oh, Timer Boy. Hammer. Means leaving a few things behind. That's Echo Which talking. Echo? Let's him continue and what And he here, said before we go, ago. oh my god, bye. Yeah. Okay, I want to get to... Th- this is very interesting, right? Yeah. So this in itself could be a transformed hex gem. It could be mm. something else entirely different. Mm. But it is creepy AF. Mm-hmm. All right, let's get to... Yeah, okay. Wow. So she is going through a lot, okay? Like, she yeah. even she even dyed her eyebrows. Look at her eyes. Her eyes are black. Let me see. Yeah, let me see. Oh, yeah. Her eyes are black and everything. Wow. Okay, bye. It's kind of scary, but I also want to hug her. Okay, so here's the jacket that we saw. Yeah. It looks like it's got some kind of... Sur- it looks like it's the same jacket she had before, but painted black. Look at the style of well, it. Well, it does, but here's mm-hmm. the thing. We have this new addition here. Mm-hmm. If she did take her jacket and added stuff and changed it mm-hmm. black, this almost kind of looks like... Uh, it, Cerberus's or do- something like that, but she's mm. cheering, so she's in a fighting ring. It looks like, yeah. And then I don't know who that was. Okay, let's see here. Ah, come back to the screen, please. Oh, oh! I hate it here. Savika versus Caitlyn. See, okay, she okay, has her okay, pinned okay. up against a wall. Caitlyn is like she's Darth Vader, but making contact. But here's the thing. <sighs> 
I don't... This is very interesting, because let's go switch back to season one, uh -huh. when Caitlyn took a warning shot on Savika. She did do so that. So she's getting revenge, and I'm not happy about it at all. Why did I pause uh, on that, KB? Uh, okay, then we got this ooh. blowy uppy thing, uh, and we got Jinx with blood. Uh -huh. We got Caitlyn with a... Wow, Caitlyn, that yeah. is some gun you got there. Where's your cute little hat? That is really... I wonder... Look, it's Hextech. It is Hextech. <gasps> you can yeah. see the blue glow. Yeah. Yeah, well, it, when we saw the trailer with her with her sniper, I was like, it's probably Hextech that they're using, because they're sure as heck not using Shima. Mm -hmm. She looks like she wants to kill someone. I hate mm -hmm. to see that she does. Okay, then we've got this fight going on right here. Then we've got Vi with her gauntlets. Bye. No longer with the dark hair. Mm -hmm. There's Caitlyn again with a downed enforcer. Oh, wow. then stop me. Mm -hmm. Okay, <gasps> never mind. Never mind. She's wearing a very colorful uh -huh. robe, but I'm sorry. It looks really cool. Yeah. Okay. People are going to cosplay the heck out of this. Okay. I mean, mm -hmm. like, she looks really cool, but she you know does. what? She does look like she's taking the role of a savior, mm -hmm. right? She even has, like, she's got war paint on her, too, but she still mm -hmm. has her very bright, funky, creepy colors. Mm -hmm. And she also has got purple hair now. Yeah. That's wild, Jinx. Yeah. Okay. Okay. There's Vi <gasps> jumping down. It looks like she's jumping on the thing with Echo. Yup, yup. Uh, she looks like she's not in good shape either. Mm -mm. And they're riding the thing oh that he created. That shows the like they're working together. Oh, hey, hey, uh huh. Hey, some time has got to have passed. Look at Vi's sure, long hair. Longer. Okay, and that doesn't happen over and over. <gasps> yeah. Who is this? Uh, this is a kid. Yeah. Outstretched hand has their own version of water paint on with someone in shadow here. Well, you know what I'm I'm wondering if that's because a bunch of people put like the powder colored hair in. Yeah. So I don't know if that's the kid's real hair color Could be. or if it's powder. Here's something interesting though. Hair color. This kid is completely visible. This mm -hmm. person is not. Yeah. Mm. Okay, okay, okay. That's very interesting. Yeah. Okay, then we get Heimer. Oh, oh! Is that Kate? Oh, Caitlyn with one of those, um, gosh, those shimmer thingy peoples uh. in the armor. There's Heimer again. Uh -huh. Some explosions. I don't know who that is. Is that? It looks like Vi. It I could see a gauntlet. be Vi, but it looks like Vi. It could me. be. Yeah. All right. So yeah, I say we make a new segment of the video and watch it one more time. <laughs> we don't know if it'll if if YouTube will allow it, but. Let's try one more watch. All right, we're watching it again because, yeah. you know, you gotta watch so much times. Yes. You were right. Oh, boy. You were right, Kate. She called her Kate? She did. That's the first time we've heard her call her Kate? Yes. Oh. Mm. Wait, that one. Well, she's laughing. We did hear the laugh. Uh. I did. Whoa, it just gives me chills. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Oh, I want to hug Vi so much. Mm. So intense. This song ah. is so good, though. Mm. This is huh? very interesting. Uh huh. Your symbol. I think she said your symbol. Your symbol, yeah. She's gonna burn everything. Of course she is. Oh! I know. Bye! I know. It's a match burning. That has some symbolism right there. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Wow. Wow. I know. Oh my goodness. So many people are gonna get hurt. Oh yeah. Every, Every ending. ending. Ugh, yeah. Is a new beginning. Mm. Here we go. The arcane is waking up. Mm. Uh. Uh. Wow. wow. Echo looks really cool. Yeah, they all look really cool. Can't wait to see Caitlyn in action. I know. Can't wait to see. Look at what Vi has. She has like these big like i don't know armor pieces look at her go her with echo together it's just oh my god i goodness. really think that kid's very significant wow. because there's no there's just there's a lot of focus on that really yeah. quick shot hmm. okay yeah 
So my only complaint is we don't have a date in November. Yeah. That's when I was only driving complaint. back over here, KB was like, maybe we'll finally get the date. <laughs> we'll finally know. Hey, this could be it. They're going to tell. No. no. They, they still the, haven't told I, I us. I feel like this is not the last that we've seen, obviously, because mm-hmm. right now it's September. We still have some time before November hits. Yeah. So I'm assuming they're going to have more stuff coming out as mm-hmm. they did. My understanding they did prior when the first season came out as well. Yeah. So, a couple things, a mm-hmm. lot of couple things, but essentially, <laughs> a is two. we do have a lot of interesting stuff going on with Cupcake. Mm. <sighs> Our beloved Cupcake is going through some shit. The thing shit. about it is that she's very, mm-hmm. very sweet, kind, and caring, and mm-hmm. she's never really said these kinds of things. Yeah. So, when she says, I want to rip the laugh from her throat... We're probably going to get that, Caitlin, yeah. which is going to hurt me a lot because she's yeah. my best girl, but uh, understandably so. It mm-hmm. really does seem, and I still have a small sliver of hope that Cassandra's okay. Maybe she's mm-hmm. just really hurt. Maybe she's just in a wheelchair. I don't know. We saw Victor, so we know mm-hmm. he's okay as much as he mm-hmm. can be, and mm-hmm. we saw a lot of other interesting things here. We have the reverse. We have Jinx, who is posed to be the hero mm-hmm. that's going to save the Undercity, mm-hmm. unlike Silco who essentially tried to control the Mm -hmm. Undercity, which is very interesting, right? Yeah. And Savika is trying to coach her or guide her in a way so she will do this. And Mm -hmm. you see all the blue hair. You see the mural with her and Vander, which is very Mm -hmm. interesting, right? Yeah. And Vi seeing that has to have a lot of emotion and turmoil. Oh, yeah. It it does seem that Vi as well is going through a lot of stuff. Mm -hmm. So my essential theory is that we're not going to see Enforcer Vi right away. Mm -hmm. We're probably going to see uh, Ring Fighter Vi. (laughs) <laughs> Ring okay. fighter Vi, mm-hmm. brawler Vi, in mm-hmm. this black outfit with the black hair, black eyebrows, black eyes, black face paint, mm-hmm. and then eventually she'll join the enforcers. I don't know. I I don't know. I, I I'm curious. I mean, there must be a time skip in this. There has to be. Yeah. Like, when we pause. And we looked at that mm-hmm. scene of Vi, and she mm-hmm. has, like, hella long hair. Mm-hmm. It takes a long time to grow your hair like that. Mm-hmm. So I don't know what time kind of what kind of time skip we're going to get. Mm-hmm. I think the other thing that they could do is they could have Enforcer Vi, and she's working together with Caitlyn, but Caitlyn mm-hmm. is so obsessed with Jinx that she has to just get away from it because she can't mm-hmm. handle it because she's like, you're like Jinx. That would be awful for her to say that. Mm-hmm. Who knows she will? And then she starts doing all this. I don't know. Mm-hmm. It's going to hurt. I can already yeah. say it's going to hurt. Well, what I was mentioning is in the beginning, it does seem like it touches on that time right after they left off with season one. It does. It does. So it seems like it starts with that, Mm -hmm. and then there's some kind of time skip. It seems like there may be multiple time skips. I, 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 I'm, I'm feeling that mm-hmm. with multiple time skips, mm-hmm. but also, too, if they're really wanting as yeah, well, too. yeah, they could essentially <laughs> give us this stuff in a different order. Uh-huh. Like, I don't know if they're going to pick up right where they left off. Like, mm-hmm. they very well could do that, or mm-hmm. they could have something else happen, and then mm-hmm. they could have flashbacks to what happened before. Mm-hmm. Getting that still image of the council, the uh, bird's eye view, mm-hmm. with all the glowing seats... That is something. So mm-hmm. perhaps that's that. And then we see, you know, fish bones doing fish bones' thing, mm-hmm. which that's not great. I'm wondering if that's also putting us in the position of, hey, we already knew that Mel was at the front of the attack, though, because mm-hmm. her back is to it and you hear the ching and the metal and whatever. Mm-hmm. So it's going to be interesting to see what happens with that. Mm-hmm. Her mother is out for blood. So that also makes me concerned that Mel is probably a casualty. Ooh. Maybe she's just really hurt. The hard thing about it is I don't think everyone in the council, obviously, Jace is not going to die. Mm-hmm. They have yet to kill any of the original League characters yeah. thus far, so I right. don't think they would do that. Yeah, because this is canon to the League, so mm-hmm. it would make no sense. Yeah. That. So there's that. Who mm-hmm. is she talking to in the chair? Could be Jace. He could have gotten really hurt. We don't know. Mm-hmm. But it's gonna be a wild ride. Mm-hmm. Ella said it herself months ago. It's going to hurt. Uh, it's gonna be devastating. It's gonna hurt me like this. And Arcane. the fact that this is it, right? Yeah. This is it for Arcane, at least. Yeah. I thought it was very interesting too, with that line with mm-hmm. the Arcane is taking over. Mm, that was that's very interesting. Because yeah. this whole series is called Arcane. Yeah. Right. And if we go back to the beginning of I forget what episode it was, but mm-hmm. with little Jace and then meeting that mage guy mm-hmm. and seeing magic. And then Heimer also mentioned it. He could see like what certain thing could what could do. He's had mm-hmm. so many lifetimes. Yeah. So there's a lot that could happen. I don't know if this is gonna end happy. Yeah. It doesn't really... I, I don't think it is. It doesn't really have that kind of feel to it. Uh, I feel like we're gonna have happy stuff, 
Yeah. But at the end of the day... Or, like, mamas were happy Jinx about. Jinx needs to be stopped. Yeah. I doubt that she'll be killed off. Mm-hmm. I doubt any of the main characters will be killed off. I mm-hmm. mean, if they did that, that would be quite something. I did mm-hmm. see a theory that someone really wants Caitlyn to be killed off, and that's mm-hmm. terrible. Or Vi, and I'm like, why? Mm-hmm. But... Yeah, I can't wait to see this new role that Jinx is going to play, right. because I was very curious how she was going to act after mm-hmm. season one, because mm-hmm. essentially, as soon as, you know, Vi wouldn't kill Caitlyn, and then Silco's gone, and she sat in the seat with Jinx, mm-hmm. not the set with Powder, so I'm mm-hmm. going to be wondering, too, if we see any of, like, what's been going on with her, because the girl has definitely got PTSD, for sure, if we're going to see any of those, yeah. like, illusions, if you mm-hmm. will, of, you know, the other people in her life. Mm-hmm. I also want to know, like, how she gets these people to rally with her. Probably Sabika's help, because the last yeah. time we did see Jinx, she was about to get beaten up really badly until Sabika saved the day. And she's not super charismatic. She's like, not. When she was leaving, she's just calling that guy Chuck, and he's like, that's not my name. Like, she's... Thanks for the drink, Chuck! Yeah. Um, yeah, she doesn't se- seem like someone that is... A smooth talker, or anything like that. She seems like someone who's very smart, but and very playful. Yeah, she can have that very childlike look on her face. That's true. That's reminiscent of Powder, because mm-hmm. she just does that stuff. Mm-hmm. Also, I'm really curious about the different colors that symbolize what's happening in Piltover and also mm-hmm. in that mural. You see all those yeah. colors, and Sabika said, let your colors blah, blah, blah. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, okay, what is this colors? Like, is this going to turn people into something? Like, what's mm-hmm. happening here? It looks really bad. And honestly, like, what kind of savior can Jinx really be? She's she's a very interesting Harley Quinn Joker, Mad Hatter kind of character. Mm-hmm. So it's like, okay... But I really like her new outfit. I'm so, I am I like her, like, her shaman kind of look. <laughs> it looks kind of cool. Yeah. She got, like, this hair and the purple hair, and then she's got yeah. all these X's on her. Yeah. But I am also curious if we're going to get a showdown between Caitlyn and Jinx. Mm, have, I wouldn't be We're surprised. getting one again, but Jinx and Vi, because yeah. of the, one of the trailers, we definitely saw them facing off mm-hmm. each other. Vi yep. didn't have the really long pink hair, though. Mm-hmm. They might do multiple showdowns. <laughs> okay. What about Savika versus Caitlyn? That's going to be interesting. I'm nervous for that one. Yeah. yeah. That said, Caitlyn's pretty smart. She is. So I think she has that quality of just like when um, they were in danger and she realized that she the building could be taken down. Yeah. Um, she really is, is good at finding very unique ways to get herself out of trouble. It's going to mm-hmm. be hard to watch that, Caitlyn. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Ooh. You're just gonna want to give Caitlyn all the hugs. Mm-hmm. Yeah, well, everyone has a dark side to them. Yeah. Right? It's just certain things have to bring it to fruition, mm-hmm. and what's going on in the end of season one definitely mm-hmm. can help that, because if you really think about it, Caitlyn had a chance to stop Jinx, mm-hmm. and she didn't do it because Vi mm-hmm. said, she's my sister. Yeah. Yep. So that's gonna come back and hurt. Mm-hmm. Also, I don't know if they'll talk about it, because I don't know how significant it is anymore, of, you know, why Grayson died, that Vi knew about that. Mm-hmm. I don't know if that's going to come around or not. I'm not mm-hmm. sure. But I do feel like what didn't happen in season one is going to come around with the whole Jinx almost getting killed by Caitlyn. Yeah. Woo! <sighs> Watching this, it just was visually stunning. Oh, yeah. For two minutes and 20 Gorgeous. seconds. They're so good at, like, pulling you in. Yeah. Like, more, please. Can I have some more? <laughs> but... Like, visually just gorgeous. Oh, yeah. And it, it really reminds me of how Arcane is, it looks like fine art in motion. It does. It's such it does. a work of art. It it, it mm-hmm. really really is. They take mm-hmm. the 2D and they mix it so well with the 3D and literally anything you can pause at is like mm-hmm. boom wallpaper still. Yeah. So. It belongs it, in a museum. It really does. Yeah. I, I'm very, it's going to mm-hmm. be a wild ride. Mm-hmm. Oh, boy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I know it's gonna be hard for you to watch Ring uh, Brawl, uh, fight Ring Fighter Vi. Uh, I will definitely watch because <laughs> I always watch Vi fighting, and every time True. she gets hurt, I'm like, no, that, that's no. That's 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 yeah, I I feel bad for her, but I'm looking forward to seeing because I know she can bring it too. Yeah, yeah, that's gonna be. I wonder if we're gonna really fun to who see. we're gonna meet the fight in the scenes. fighting ring. If mm. there'll be anyone significant there. 
good question. I have a lot of questions, a lot of theories, but honestly, yeah. this video could be a lot longer than it is. Because <laughs> uh, then I'm watching this trailer and going back to other trailers and going back to season one, I'm what I remember, but I'm like, hmm. Yeah. Okay. I really do think there's something to do with that kid, though, and that person in the doc figure. I don't mm. know. We'll have to see. Yeah. And really, in the first act of season one, you see them as kids. And there's this quality of, like, childlike living in this setting that just isn't wholesome or childlike at all. And these kids having to face these really harsh living conditions. So I think that's very con- that very significant. Yep. <sighs> Mm-hmm. It's gonna hurt so good when it yeah. finally comes out. Yeah, they're just kids, but they face con- real consequences. They do. They absolutely do for things that happen. They absolutely yeah. do. Ever mm-hmm. since they were really small, and by lost their parents to the mm-hmm. enforcers, and then eventually, enforcer yeah. lost Vander because of the incident with Powder, and mm-hmm. got stuck in still water for and something she didn't do. When they went to Piltover, mm-hmm. and then all the enforcers came down and were messing up the whole Undercity. Yep, because they went over to Jason's apartment. Yep. So there are all kinds of consequences, and they're just kids. So yeah, I do think that's that's a big part of it. Mm-hmm. 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 Ah, my brain is still loading this beautiful trailer. Yep. And I'm definitely gonna watch it a bunch more. Oh times. heck yeah! Yeah. There's a lot to like. Really, you ha- like a lot of the really quick moving scenes. You just catch mm-hmm. briefly and you get the pop. What is that, right? Yeah. Like you see Savika holding Kaylin up, and that's like a sec. And I'm like, what mm-hmm. was that? I'm like, oh my gosh. Yeah. So yeah, it's so gonna be me watch some more. To probably analyze some more off camera because there's a lot mm-hmm. to look at that. You know. Yeah. Whew. Yeah. And we are soon going to be doing a rewatch of yep. season one of Arcane. We will be doing So one. if you're a fan of Arcane, make sure that you stick around because that's coming. And then we are going to have a party. Yes. Yeah. A li- so we'll fun. be on live yes. on the channel. Yes. Uh, so our whole community can join in yeah. for that. And we're going to just obsess over Arcane more. <laughs> 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 Anything else going on that you want to talk about? Daughter Caitlin. Um, I can't. I'm, I mean, it's it's. Ugh, mm. It hurts my soul. Mm. Yeah, but I mean, if she wasn't affected by any of this, it wouldn't be realistic. So mm. yeah, I think we're gonna wrap up there. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Thanks so much for hanging out with us while we watch this super exciting trailer for Arcane season two. And if you enjoyed hanging out with us here and would like to chat in with us live, you can join our YouTube channel membership where we do monthly live streams. Look forward to connecting with you again soon and we will be sending so much love. Till next time. Laters.